Hey guys, Blow Leader here. And as of today, it has been one year of being on YouTube. This is just so cool. I didn't think I'd make it this far. And even better, we have hit 100 subscribers. There are now 100 blue orange juices out in the world. Yes, my mascot is a blue orange juice. Don't judge me. So to celebrate these monumentous occasions, I thought I wanted to take a little trip down memory lane as we take a look at some old wooden railway remakes I made. So in case some of you guys don't know, I make a lot of remakes. And it first started with these Thomas Wooden Railway remakes that I made. I made these with like my little brother and they were a lot of fun to do, but they really don't hold up too well. So if this video gets a lot of views, we might finish a lot of them. I made a bunch of them. I made like eight here for season one. I made three from season two and then this one Great Wooden Railway race. So maybe I'll split this into three parts, but for the first part, we're going to take a look at Thomas Gets Tritt, Edward Helps Out, Come Out Henry, and then Henry to the Rescue. Alright, so i am got to check the volume. Alright, now let's get started. I haven't seen these in a while, so this is ought to be interesting. <laughs> oh my god, the nostalgia. Now that's my brother who's spinning the windmill. You can see the little foot. <laughs> and there's just Gordon sitting there like, uh, I'm not on the rails, guys. Yeah, I've always preferred Ringo Starr to George Carlin. I, I mean, I, I, I think so. Oh my god, I remember this. Short stumpy boiler and a short stumpy dome. I didn't use any transitions back then. Or maybe I did, I don't know. It just stops. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I didn't have enough coaches, so I was just like, yeah, we'll just do one. <sighs> I actually only have two of those express coaches, so that's kind of why. I have a little slow coach, I could have just used that. Oh well, whatever. You can tell, like, what's a picture and what's a video, because, like, the picture's a lot skinnier. I, I don't know why that was, it was just something with my iPod. I don't know what it was, but whatever, it still works. I have to pull in the big express. Golden arrived at the back of the side and very tired. Oh, wait. wait, no, that's Navarro Station. That says Tinman Station. What? Oh, these jump cuts. They don't fit with the episode. Oh my god. The timing. I found much better at timing for my remakes, but oh, it was so bad. I don't think Edward was in the shed during that episode. Oh, I could have got that timing right. What the heck? Oh my god. Wait, he wasn't called for that. What? What? <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna have to cut a lot of this out because I'm not getting that much reactions, but. Whatever. Oh, that's so high-pitched. I'm not gonna turn it down just so it can actually be heard, but like... Oh, that sounds so high-pitched. Come on, come on! Wait. Yo, it's the top of my hat! So actually, that tunnel is actually really small, so I had to do a couple trips with the camera to make it look bigger. And I gotta say, I'm kind of impressed with how I did that. I still do that in a couple of my other remakes too. Like I think the Hidden Elephant remake, I did something like that. Wow, that is so fast. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, for sitting there. I still kind of do pictures like for when they're supposed to be moving. 
is kind of because I'm a little lazy and it's kind of, it's hard to try to get them moving. The exact same station where they came from. <laughs> Yo, Topham. Topham's here. The hat has entered the chat. Hey, that rhymes. Oh my god. I don't know. Okay, so that episode, it, it, I think it it was okay. Like, I mean, like, uh, the hand, it's just, oh, it looks so bad. I use strings now, and it's a lot better. I mean, you can still tell it's there, but at least it doesn't look ridiculous as like this. Alright, let's move on to Edward. Wait, hold on. I think that's different. Yeah, it was the two to <laughs> I think I had to make... The same thing over and over again because I didn't save that movie at the time. Whew. It's not even centered. Look at it. It's just like. Uh, this one's also told by Ringo Starr. Well, I didn't even realize it's like Birdie right there. He's just kind of chilling, you know. Oh, I remember filming this at night. So I used my lamp like I have. So. It looks like a sunset, even though it's in the morning, in, in the episode. I honestly didn't care at the time, but now I'm like, no, the line has to be perfect. Hey, that's Lego Duplo Gordon, not Edward. <laughs> oh, yes, please, said Edward. So the lid is fine. I mean, lots of steam. Edward <laughs> Oh my god, that finger! What the heck? It was just like... Uh... <laughs> the coaches went the wrong way, and then it was like, what? I think this was like right after I made the first one, so I was like, oh my god, I gotta like do this. Oh, oh my god, that looks awful. Those lines. You can't even tell what it is. What the heck? Oh my god, that's tripped on memory lane. Ah, there you go, that's some good lining right there. Do you watch me, little Edward? That will be a sight for you. Or a splendid sight. Yo, Topham's still there. What was that? Was that my hand? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo, wait, what? Toby. <laughs> the beach ball and telescope. Oh my god. I think there was supposed to be one more scene between those. Oh my god, Gordon. A freight train, a freight train, a freight train. Grumbled. The shame of it, the shame of it, all oh, the shame of it. I claim, I, I think I was trying to get the timing a bit more right for this episode, but like, I didn't. So, I don't even know. Oh my god, it's another nighttime scene. What driver? Was that the Dodge? Was that just me filming for that long? I don't even know. Uh, 
Uh, what are those random stops? They look so bad. Oh my god, the time for this episode is... My god. Oh my gosh. What? I used a transition there! But they don't even fit, it's just like... There. <laughs> Rips her top of my hat. Oh, didn't say thank you, that is terrible. Yeah, it's a pretty long drink. Yo, that sick Lato dude. I still use him for my Lato remakes. Oh yeah, there is that end credits scene. Wow, at the time it was totally off to get to that scene. That turned out alright, I guess. There was a lot of things wrong. I mean, I was still proud of this at the time, but like, oh my gosh, it still don't hold up. Uh, oh well, next one it is then. Alright, I'm out, Henry. Wow, good time. Gordon's just looking. I think I remember this one has a lot of stock footage in it. Like, I use a lot of the same picture. It was kind of lazily done, if you ask me. You don't even have Edward Doyle. Oh, you can't see him! Oh my god. You can still see the other end. It, it did it okay for, for, for Thomas. It's trip. Why did it didn't work there? Oh my god. The rain will spoil my lovely green paint with red stripes. One of these gate uh, one of these days I'm gonna do that remake with my playrail engines. And it's gonna be so lazily done. Like, oh my gosh. That one surfer dude. <laughs> what about for Sir Topham Hat? I just use my bed. I, I don't know why. It's just like. Oh my gosh. I don't even know. We. Yeah. It looks more like they're pushing him. <laughs> because um, he said, I'll do this. He bid me to pull. Oh my god. So much memories from this. One, two, three, push. Long stretch of silence. <laughs> This has to be one of the most boring episodes to watch, I gotta say. I know some people who really like this episode. What, what, what is that? Just scratching his butt. I think this net scene's supposed to look really good. I mean, I don't really remember it being any good, but like, maybe it is, I don't know. It's such a puny wall, it's so bad. I remember some things. It's not even time for I'd super dumb. <laughs> Look, you can just run that over. And, and another plot hole I realized was like, why can't Henry just go backwards through the tunnel? He, he didn't. The next episode, but like, he didn't. Did his like driver and fireman ditch him? I don't even know. Peep, peep. Hello. Hello. And Gordon would always say poop, poop, poop. So right. I gotta say, I'm getting a little bit used to this. Like, the wooden railing, how cheesy it looks. 
Uh, again, you can see the other side of the tunnel. Okay, so that one, again, I, it was kind of lazily put together, but, I mean, it's a come out, Henry. What do you expect? You're going to use a lot of the same stuff over and over again. It looks okay, at least. All right, let's... Again, this will be the last episode for today, guys, by the way. Oh, my God, this scene was a pain to film. We don't even get it just right. I remember getting really mad. That's my brother. We had a jump cut? Yeah, I guess, because again, you know, that scene was just really hard to film. How fast. So fast! With random pauses in between. Wait, Sir Topham Hatch and the coaches, why, why is he there? Did I like put any thought into this? I think I remember I didn't change the set just so I could just keep him in the tunnel like that or something. Henry didn't know how to ask. To be fair, I wouldn't know how to ask to get out of the tunnel either. Now that's the way to Duplo Gordon. What's... Why did I just talk right there? This is why I don't do one in my life remix anymore. The engines are so cumbersome. I'll do one like every once- I probably will do one every once in a while, like for a movie remake or something. But I think I want to start a series. <laughs> it's, I kind of want to start a little mini-series where it's kind of- Kind of like- It's- How do I say- It's going to be kind of like a mix of Thompson's Playrail Friends and the Lato Dupla shorts. There's going to be a sense of humor like the shorts, but they're going to be more like episode-long things. Look at Gordon there, he's just like so sad. They look so old, look at all the edges. Now <laughs> you can see my shorts. The kill the dairy right next to the tennis station. Boom. Gordon, that's no use. And we can't pull the train. Oh, oh, I did it like that? Huh, I did it like the book, or like they double head the train. But it's like two coaches, like how can... I mean, I, I mean, Edward can pull coaches just fine. I don't know, this episode doesn't make any sense. Season 1 wasn't perfect, but I, I still like it fine. I have to say though, the original like, sets weren't the best episodes. I like the first episode, but like, you know, it's... Yeah, dear old Thomas. Stiff. I am stiff. Like me. I... Oh, I'm stiff too. Stiff from watching this. <laughs> just stare at that picture all day. Wow. Well, that's just great. But Gordon is derailed. <laughs> Peep, peep. I'm ready. Peep, peep. <laughs> oh my god, Rainbow Star was so good. I prefer Rainbow Star to se in season two because he because he kind of figured it out in season two. It's a shame he only narrated like 17 episodes for the U.S. Man, there's so many scenes that I just put together instead of making separate ones. I try to go scene by scene for my remakes now. But I didn't care back then. <laughs> but then I don't use the Lego. What? What? That's not a go- I, What? What is this? What is that picture? Oh my god, this is so bad. Oh, now we use a different station. That's some sign of being better. Oh my gosh. There's Edward back there. Wait, is that like the ocean back there? What was that pause? Okay, so again, that one was pretty bad. I gotta say, I'm taking a pretty 
I'm just getting a really like, a little road of nostalgia here. It's kind of nice, I must admit. But that's going to be all for this, guys. If this video gets like a lot of views, I'll try to put the sequel out pretty fast. Again, thanks for like one year of being a Blue OJ. And we're about 100 as this video is being released, so that's really cool. Anyway, I guess I'll see you next time. Peace. So that's going to be all for this video, guys. Be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you haven't already, and let me know in the comments what you thought of this video. But that's all for now, guys. This is the Blue OJ Leader, and I'll see you later.